Hey guys, welcome back to Mike at Midnight. I'm Mike, it's Midnight, let's game. We're here with Mercenary Kings, and, uh... So, I mean... It's, it's got a story here that I'm gonna talk all over because you can read the subtitles. Because that's how it's all conveyed. <laughs> but... Claw has struck, dun-dun-dun. I'm here with Caleb, and once we get through the intro here, we'll I join together. To say. I, hey, I'll introduce you when I introduce you. You calm your tits, all right? I don't have any. Yet. Even if I were a girl, I don't. I wouldn't have any. That's just how skinny I am. Caleb, that was sexist as hell. You apologize. Yeah, it's sexist. And you know what's out there? A pole answer. So go get it. Uh, what? Like, I legitimately missed that, would you say? <laughs> oh, that dude got cut in half. Oh, that... Oh, what? He got cut in half? Yeah, what did you say, though? Uh, there's a pole answer, so go get it. Uh, a what answer? Pole answer. I don't know. You know what? I, I didn't talk. I didn't hear anything. You, you heard You nothing. did, and, and you know what? You heard nothing. We're, we're, you yeah, heard no, you're, you're nothing. failing. I still want an apology. To all my women viewers out there, I want you to apologize right now. Apologize. I, I am sorry for offending go. anybody out there. Please okay. forgive me. And Thank you should you. hear Michael when he's off, ca off camera. What? Uh, <laughs> I am the least offensive person ever in the history of all time, okay? Uh huh. <laughs> shut, you shut your dirty mouth. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so yeah, mercenary kings. Um, I know what it looks like. It looks kind of like a metal slug style kind of thing, but it's it's yeah. got the um the art style from uh from Scott Pilgrim versus the World. Yeah, ju just so everybody knows, we have had first-hand experience with this game. Yes, we have played around with it. So, it looks like your standard run and gun, but you do have to reload. So, like, in the vein of, like, uh, what do you call it, Metal Slug or, you know, Contra, but a little more strategy-based and kind of an open-world arena kind of deal. So, uh, plus RPG-style upgrades. It is immaculate. Isn't it, right? Like, oh yeah, definitely. So, I'm gonna grab some C4 here. Type C4. Same. We're going through the tutorial. In case of yeah, and the, uh, I, I don't want to kill the bunnies. I, I'm just gonna tell you how there are some points where we might have to hunt animals for for, you know, upgrades. We we do not condone the we animal condone hunting. Animal violence. No, we we're not fans of it. It is very terrible and it's it's like it's like the Assassin's Creed games, you know, you can hunt oh, oh the bunny. Good to be a king. I don't you know, to you them. you you hunt for upgrades, but after that you kinda like stop killing the animals because you feel bad for them, you know. I mean, there's certain animals where I'm cool, cool hunting, like in like in the Assassin's Creed games, like deer and bears and shit like that. I'm cool hunting, but when that yeah. like make me kill a beaver, I don't. I feel bad about that, you know. Well, yeah, it's like, what did he do wrong to you? It's like he's not even gonna give you that much food. It's more fur. It's beaver pelt. Or, or fur, yeah. But again, we do not condone animal violence on this show. No, no, we do not. Terrible. So right now we're just kind of introducing everybody. Uh, you go to various people for, you know, your upgrades, you know, your carry-out mission. Everything works on a central hub kind of system, so...
Okay. Oh, I am. All I've had today to eat is a pop tart. All I had to eat was a gingerbread man. Dude, that's not good for you. I mean, gingerbread men are awesome, but you should probably eat something stronger than a gingerbread man. With cereal help? It probably would at some point. Once, by, Maybe once we're done of recording no, like, this episode. No, like I, I did have some cereal. What, what did you have? It's, it's kind of like... Um, it's kind of like Cocoa Pebbles, but it's like a brand that nobody knows of, because you know how Mom is organic, right? Oh, uh, yeah, you, know, you don't even have to say anything more. That's what All right. it is. Uh, let's bring you in. Alright, finally. Again, shut your dirty mouth. You're the one with the dirty mouth. You're the one with the dirty butthole. You yeah, got nothing on that one, do ya? <laughs> well, first of all... Well, first of all, how would you even know? i just assume. Oh, uh, crap. What? I'm starting to hear an echo. Which probably means I need to mute you. Oh, I probably need to do the same. Uh, voice chat. There we go. Off. Okay, there we go. You know what, um, cause this is the first time, uh, I will, this, me and, me and Caleb never recorded before today, so, um, Caleb, I think we're gonna have to play around with your Discord a little bit, cause I need, I think I need to turn you up a little bit. I don't Possibly. know, I'll have to, yeah. I'll have to look back, but you're, you're kind of, you're fainter than I'd like you to be, I guess, is... But maybe yeah. I'm just hard of hearing. Ah, God no, damn it. I can hear you perfectly fine. Okay, but we do like killing these little bastards, because they're evil. Yeah, those guys are freaking annoying. So, and they're red dots on them. So they need to die. Right, Michael? Oh, of course. So right now our guns kind of suck because it's the basic, kind of. you know, gun. Okay, comparatively, but what we were using before, they super suck. <laughs> yeah. But the idea is that you kill enemies, grab um, uh, awesome stuff. stuff to upgrade, and then what you do is um, oh, um, god damn it, um. Oh, I lost my train of thought. Oh, and then once you complete the missions, you gain money, and then you use the money and the um, materials to upgrade guns, armor, uh, buy stuff, create, uh, you know, extra mods and stuff like that, so. Yeah. You know those weren't going to harm us, right? Yeah, but... You know, they all They're need to daily die. red dots. I know. I know. I know how that works. Crap. Uh, oh. How much health do you have? Uh, barely any. Uh, you know what? Let me use my ration. Um, if you die, you get 30 seconds for your teammate to try to revive you. After which... Oh, hey, where are we going? Oh, hey, to the infirmary. end. Okay, yeah, it'll be quicker to go up. Yeah, um... Infirmary, dude. Why? Did you not see, did you not oh. see the infirmary? Okay, yeah, I guess. Um, so if you go in the infirmary here and just kind of hang out, uh, your health will go back up. Um, so certain uh, certain levels will have certain goals. Um, but the thing is, if you die, you have 30 seconds to revive. If you don't revive, then you die. Uh, you start back in an infirmary and you lose a life. Even in multiplayer, you only get three tries to finish a mission, at which point the mission fails. And for each subsequent life you lose, uh, your money is cut off. So, yeah. like, I think our reward for this one is 500 so, yeah, yeah. E every time we die, we, we would lose $100. Yeah. 
No, you would lose exactly one quarter of it all. Oh, right. What the hell is a quarter of 500 then? 125. 125, yeah. right? Yeah, so we'd lose 125. Because Mike is good at math. <laughs> and I suck at it, clearly. Obviously. You're you're just terrible at at the uh, arithmetics. Ow. <laughs> I'm good at catching bullets with my face. You know, that's not necessarily a good thing, right? You know, Mom always said that, and I was like, Mom, that's crazy. I mean, look how many bullets I can catch with my face. <laughs> What's the downside of it all, really? I, I don't... I have yet to see one. Uh, this way, buddy. Okay, wait, where are we? Okay. We gotta go... You gotta, you gotta go back up. Okay. And then we gotta fight the, the snails. Oh god, the snails. I hate the snails. I hate the snails, too. You know what I found works great on the snails, though? Uh... No, caustic. Oh really? Yes, it eats away at their shells, so you can you can do damage to them when you shoot them, even when they're not covered. Nice. Yeah. And now we got our gunsmith. Yay! Also, in this game. They somehow managed to add jiggle effects to pixels. Yeah, but so they did that on Scott Pilgrim vs. The World too. It's not hard with pixels. Pixels is easy to do jiggle effects.